New tonight, we're following an off-duty officer-involved shooting that happened early this morning. Thanks for joining us after the game. I'm Courtney King. Our Alexis Martin joins us live from the Hamilton County Sheriff's Department after speaking with neighbors. Alexis. We're told a Hamilton County deputy arrived home from work early this morning when he found an alleged intruder in his home. The officer then shot the intruder who ran away. Police tell us after hours of searching, they arrested Daryl Williams and charged him with aggravated burglary. Police go in everybody's backyards and they were looking in the woods behind my house and they were jumping fences going up the street in the backyards and um, yelling at people to get in their houses. A neighbor who didn't want to show her face on camera tells us she didn't hear any gunshots, but did hear police arrive at the scene. You're seeing video she took of the heavy police presence on the street. Reading police and the Hamilton County deputies responded to Keith Drive around 5.30 this morning for reported shots fired. Investigators say a deputy found an intruder in his home when he got back from work. <laughs> the coincidence of that is just wild. And that's when we started hearing that. We're like, as he was coming home, it's 5.30 in the morning. That's the one thing that you don't expect to happen. Investigators say there was a confrontation and the deputy shot the intruder who ran away. Neighbors say there was a heavy police presence until officers found the suspect, 26-year-old Daryl Williams. When I woke up about 5.30, there was, I heard all the police cars come. There was like eight to ten of them. And they parked right in front and got the, uh, the dogs out, the canine unit. And then they got the drones out. They say Williams was shot once in the leg. Radio traffic from the search tells us Williams called someone nearby and they tried to use his number to find him. We have a cell phone for the suspect. He just used to call um, where he was at. It's possible trying to do a ping on that you know, location. We're unsure how and where police located Williams. Jake Brasher says he's never seen anything like this on his street before. And it's wild that you get to see it to the people that, you know, are as close, tight knit as we are. But you hope for people to be better. You, you hope that somebody sees this and goes, yeah, we're not going to mess around over here anymore. Brasher says this is a wake up call. Definitely does like, you know, light a fire under you like, holy crap, we got to be safer. You know, got to like be a lot more cautious and aware. But We're working to learn the details around the search and arrest for Williams. We'll update you as we get that information. Live at the Hamilton County Sheriff's Office with photojournalist Philip Krinsky, I'm Alexis Martin, Fox 19 Now.